Hey guys, in this tutorial I want to show you how you can add a blurry background to your Instagram filter in Spark AR. So yeah, let's jump right into it. So I just created a blank Spark AR project, but you can add this to any project you already have. So yeah, let's start. At first we have to extract two textures from the camera object. First the camera texture and for the second the person segmentation um, texture. So, now we have these two textures in our asset panel. For the next step, we have to create two materials. The person material, where we segmentate the person from the background and also the a background material that we will blur afterwards. So, I will call it blur. And yeah, for the person material, just set the shader type to flat. Also do this for the blur material to ensure better colors. So, now in the person material, Add to the diffuse the texture, camera texture, then activate alpha and here you have to choose the person segmentation mask. Now for the blur material, we don't have to attach a texture to this, we just have to click on this little arrow besides the texture in the diffuse layer and then it creates a, a patch in the patch editor. For the next step, we have to um, drag and drop our camera texture right into the batch editor. Now, go to the library, click on batch assets and then search for blur. Um, hit enter, then you will see this blur patch from the Spark AR assets. Click here and then import free. Now it is downloading the, the batch and you can see it now here in the assets panel under batches. Just drag and drop it into the batch editor, connect the RGBA output from the camera texture to the input texture in the blur patch and then do the output to the blur diffuse texture. Here you can set the blur amount of your filter. I will do it to 0.9 that you can see it better. And now we have to create the objects where we are um, applying the textures to. So just create a canvas object and in this canvas object create two rectangle objects. So just copy and paste it and you have two of them. I will name the first one person and the second one um, background. Just make sure the background rectangle is above the person rectangle in the scene panel. So now we see the um, two rectangles on the left upper corner in the in the preview but now we have to make sure that they are over the whole screen so just go to width set fill width and then fill height do the same for the person um, rectangle and now we can apply the materials to it for the person rectangle just apply the material person so we see we are now segmented from the background and then for the background material, just select the blur material and yeah, now you see my background is blurred and yeah, now we are done. I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial and as I said, you can here set the amount of blur. When I do it 0.2 and it's now it's less blurry in the background. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed it and if you have any questions just write a comment down below. If you like this video, thumbs up and yeah, if you want to see more Spark AR videos here, just subscribe to this channel. I will upload more um, Spark AR uh, videos to this channel. So yeah, so see you in the next video. Bye!